Last Saturday, we saw millions marching in the streets across this country, voicing their opinions about guns. Roy Wood Jr. went to the great state of Montana to report on another side of the discussion. We heard about the March for Our Lives in D.C., but there was another march going down all the way out in Helena, Montana. And out here at this march, people were taking a stand for the real victims of gun violence, guns. We're blessed to live in a state that believes in individual rights. If it wasn't for Donald J. Trump, our Second Amendment right now would be gone. And that's why they're out celebrating guns of all types. We're gun-toting Americans. Do you think our founding fathers would approve of the AR-15? Yeah, I want a tank. No, it's what I want. Wait, you want, you I, want a tank? I right? should have a tank because I should be equally armed with whatever the government has. So you're out here for the tank rally? Yeah, the tank rally. And these tank-wielding badasses have a solution to stop school shootings. We should have armed teachers. We'd be more than willing to bring them in and train them absolutely for free. All teachers? If they can pass a background check. Dude, our teacher can't pass a background check. They're high as f <laughs> I'm here because I want the kids to be safe. Is it safer to have a gun? Oh, absolutely. Firearms keep absolutely people safe. But filling our schools with guns isn't their only solution. Clear backpacks. Because you know that the student does not have a gun or something dangerous in that backpack. But I thought everybody was supposed to have a gun. Well, uh, schools and, uh, uh, but if it's a gun-free zone, then you don't want guns there. But you just said we needed more guns in school. Not by students. What we also need is clear backpacks. Yeah, clear backpacks. What else? What is the answer to stopping school shootings? All right. So, I've, I've been a cage fighter for 10 years. Wait, you what? Cage fighter. So, I made a living, right, now you're stepping back. One of the things everybody always said is, man, we should get this in one of our high schools. So we could stop people from getting guns, or we could implement cage matches in the school. Absolutely, 100%, I'm for that. I'd advocate that in a heartbeat. But is the March for Guns' real mission to expose a hidden truth about the March for Our Lives? This is the real march. Right. That other march, D.C.? Well, they're, they were paid by liberal Democrats to go there. Somebody paid for half a million people to go to D.C. today. Absolutely. That's all over the internet. It's not a secret. What about the Parkland students themselves? They're actors. They're paid actors to say that. It's hard to debate a subject when the opposite side... Just got shot at. ...is, is shouting. And I mean, shot at, not shot at. Just well, got the, shot well, at. Those, those kids are shot at. A lot of these guys are just crisis actors. They really are, though. They are. I mean, so you don't think they're actual students of Parkland? Do you? Nicholas Cruz. How did he know how to target specifically the school where the crisis actors were attending? Okay, so... Mm. You know, I'm sorry, but you just, you just opened up something that could be a conspiracy. I, didn't know, I never thought about that before. That's what we need, more conspiracies. But the conspiracy that I was on to was that even though this was a pro-gun rally, something seemed missing. Do you have your gun with you today? No. You go to a pro-gun rally without your gun. That's like being sober on Bud Light Island. I did not wear my gun here today. So if a gun makes people safer, why didn't you bring your gun here today? That is... An, that is... Actually... Turns out the organizers told these folks not to bring their guns because they were worried about safety issues. But for all of their guns, 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 these Second Amendment mother were also pretty down with the first which meant anybody could come up to the stage and speak. I know uh, Roy over here wants to say a word as well. This is the march that all the cameras should be at. Yeah. I've learned today that, you know, guns make people safe. Yeah. Which is why we didn't bring our guns today, because we understand that. Well, that didn't work. But luckily, this rally ended the way all good rallies do, with a big-ass pizza party. And that's something I'll happily open carry.